want any older team coins, head over to Moja. M M O G A H. And use the code BHC at checkout to get yourself a discount. Link is in the description. Okay, boy. Man. He doesn't score a lot of goals for us, but Michi Bacuai on Twitter is legit one of the funniest people I've ever seen. Like, he's just so f***ing funny, man. How is it going, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Brooksy HD. Today, we have the starter squad on FIFA 18. Now, obviously, it's not on FIFA 18. We're going to have to use FootWiz with all the available cards that have been made uh, to our, like, attention sort of thing by FootWiz being at the actual capture event itself. I also want to explain the coin sponsor bit at the start of the video. Um, I had to do one more video with them, and that's why it's at the start. So, apologies for that if you guys don't like that. You know, I just had to put that in there for one more video before the game comes out. So, yeah. But as I said, today we're going to be looking at a squad specifically designed around players that I think are going to be OP. Some of them will definitely be cheap and, you know, they just will definitely be good players in the game. And there's a few players that I think are going to be absolutely incredible. So before we get onto that, I just want to uh, show you guys something. It's a site called Gawkbox. I don't know whether you've used it before. It's a site that a lot of streamers use uh, on, you know, either Twitch or YouTube. The link's in the description. You just got to go and click on that on your phone or your mobile. I don't think you can do it on PC. I think it literally has to be phone or mobile. And all you do is, like, download apps. It's completely free and it's, it's a really good way for you guys to support me and, like... Uh, you know, just help me out financially. It's free for you. All you have to do is download apps, you know, play them for like a few minutes and then you can get rid of them as soon as you want. And basically that just helps me like financially. Not massively, but you know, if more people do it, the more people, you know, I can spend some of the money on FIFA points or, you know, getting stuff like that, which I really, really need at this moment in time. Let me put it that way. Also just want to say this wasn't sponsored. Uh, I just know a few people like, for example, Melee B that use this site and say it's quite good. So <laughs> I thought I'd give it a go. It's illegal for me to say that this wasn't sponsored if it was so you know i would be risking my neck this wasn't sponsored i'm telling you right now so first player we have on the list is sergio romero in goal man united goalkeeper got a bit of an upgrade looks like a really really decent goalkeeper now he's here for chemistry i reckon he's going to be quite cheap the only thing i can see maybe making his price go up to around i don't know two or three k when the game comes out is the fact that he's manchester united obviously there's no stats at this moment in time because like footways haven't actually gone into every single player's stats they've just literally gotten the card stats but looking at the card stats he looks like a decent goalkeeper on the right hand side of the defense then we have a player called david abraham or david abraham he's from argentina it's probably david let's be honest six foot two center back with 81 80 pace sorry i was gonna say 81 that would just be a lie wouldn't it 80 pace with 79 defending and 77 physical that my friends is a cheap beast if i've ever seen one and alongside him is marcus rojo probably the most expensive player in this squad when the game comes out he has a really really good center back card he was a left back card last year if you remember correctly uh, he's got 71 pace this time 80 defending and 83 physical as well well, a 69 passing. Oi! Also, just want to figure out how the hell Marcus Rojo is one rating higher than Chris Smalling. I bet you Smalling's still going to be overpowered as f in this game. And right back then, we have a very, very decent German uh, Bundesliga centre back from Hertha Berlin. He's got 84 pace, 75 passing. It's Mitchell Weiser, very, very good defender. He had four star skills on FIFA 16. I'm not so sure about FIFA 17. But if he does have four star skills at right back, you know, you cannot go wrong. At left back, then we have Andrew Robertson, the Scottish international. He signed for Liverpool, not a bad player. Uh, he's definitely going to be a cheap left back, 80 pace. He's got some really well rounded stats for a left back. He's quite tall, 5 foot 10, 80 pace, just a good left back. At the right centre mid, then we have the player I've always loved on FIFA. It is Zlatko Junozovic, Austrian international, really good player in real life. Always kind of wished he would move to the Premier League. Really good stats for a 79 rated card. This is quite good. He's got fantastic passing. And his free kicks are insane. They In real life, they're insane. So in FIFA 17 and FIFA 16, he's had insane free kicks. Definitely going to be the same in this year's FIFA. Now, at the left center mid position, we have a bit of a weird one. You guys probably were not expecting this at all. Looks like a really, really good player. Pascal Gross. He's been scoring quite a few goals. Well, not quite a few goals. I think he scored one or two for Brighton in the Premier League at the moment. He's a really, really good center midfielder. Great passing on his card. Fairly strong. Good dribbler. And just an all-around beast player. Now, he's here for chemistry at the moment. And I want to show you guys another Another option you can use from Brighton that's in centre mid. His name is Davy Proper. And this is the other option you can go for. Davy Proper, as I've already said, he is a Holland international. Very, very good centre mid. I just went for Gross because I thought I would need the German link. Turns out I didn't need it. So you can either go for Proper or for Gross in the squad builder. I've just kept Gross in there because he looks like a decent player. Although, technically, Proper does look better. Now, at the camp position, we have Marcel Sabitzer, one of the leading players for Red Bull Leipzig in the German league last year. Very, very good player. He can play on either wing and up the middle that sounded really sexual he can play a good cam role his passing isn't great but like i can probably guarantee you when his card stats his in-game stats sorry come out his passing like his short and long passing will be quite good 
good. So don't worry about that. He can score goals, which is one thing a cam always needs, especially in the formation we're using, which is the 4 3 3 4. The cam scores a lot of goals. And when you got the striker, we do, you know, just having a backup goal scorer is going to make you score so many goals. It's going to be unreal. Oh, I get mad excited when I see the new ratings, boys. It's crazy. At the right wing position, then we have Patrick Herman, one of the undersung, uh, you know, players in FIFA on the right wing from the Bundesliga in the past couple of years. He's got some really, really good card stats for a 79 rated right mid. Probably will go for around 1 or 2k when the game comes out. Fast, can shoot, can pass. Not very strong, but he's a good dribbler. He might have four-star skills. He'll probably only have three-star skills, though, because that's what he had last year. And if you were paying attention to the Brighton link in the center mid, you would probably have realized that we were going to use Jose Iscorerdo. He had a fantastic team of the season card last year on FIFA 17 with, like, 99 long shots or something like that. We brought him into this team as a very overpowered-looking card for this year's game. 81 dribbling, 93 pace, 73 shoot. We're probably going to have really good long shots. Uh, 67 passing. And quite a strong left wing at uh, 62 physical. As one of Brighton's, you know, arguably better players in the game, he looks incredible as a left wing option. Oh, he looks so good. And it had to be Timo Werner. The Red Bull Leipzig star, pr practically. Him, Keita, Forsberg and Sabitzer are probably their four best players. And they're all attacking. Uh, Werner is a fantastic player. I've really liked this guy ever since he was he blew up at 17 years old as Stuttgart. Always thought he had a bit of a future about him. Moved to Leipzig, scored a load of goals last year. And he looks insane in this game. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is the full squad. Uh, once again, I do apologize that we have to use foot whiz, but uh, I'm not known enough or relevant enough to be able to go to the capture event. And I have a coin sponsor video at the start of this, so that doesn't help. It looks like a really, really good squad. As I've already said, if you want to get rid of Pascal Gross and use Davy Proper in there, you can. I would probably say you should over a Gross, but I thought I had to use him for the German link. Turns out I didn't. And my knuckles, ow! Also, from here on out, I just want to say this for FIFA 18, I'm going to try and swear a lot lot less watching some of my videos back from last year i just realized how much i do actually swear i'll just try and be naturally funny without the wow effect of saying the f word definitely not the n word i never say that unlike pewdiepie so as you can see this team looks incredible i would be scared if i came up against this team in game obviously we don't have any clips because we haven't got the game. Once again, I'm not relevant enough to get the game early. Gotta rectify that this year, though, I promise you. And if you want to see a few more of these videos before the actual full game comes out on the 21st of September, might even be the 20th of September, uh, let me know in the comment section down below, and I will try and do as many of these as I can. The grind starts now, ladies and gentlemen. This is where I this is where I shine. I'm trying my hardest to shine from, you know, from the start of this game game i'm gonna try and push as many videos as, as out as i can make them as good as i can obviously this video isn't great because we don't have a lot to go off so yeah i'll see you next time have a wonderful day goodbye